Hello YouTube, this is Shara coming at you with another video. This is part two to my salon etiquette video. We'll call it salon etiquette 102. Uh, to me, I think that, I don't want to blame everything on the client or the stylist, but I think that you should not leave the salon until you are satisfied with your hair, your service, the whole nine. So, um, I want to talk about this video because as a stylist, I've been doing hair 12 years. Everybody has, you know, an issue somewhere or something. Somebody's not going to like your work. Everybody's not going to like your work. That's not the way it works. As a stylist, our job is to get the look you're going for effortlessly and you leave with something you're happy with. You know what I mean? Um, I'm saying this because I've been told by many people, or I, you know, just on a regular basis, we're very, very, very busy here. So we'll have five people lined up looking, you know, at us or whatever, but, you know, our hands are always moving or whatever. But the client in the chair will feel like, okay, my hair is okay, but if she could just cut this little piece, it'd be perfect. To me, I feel like I don't want to let you out of my chair unless it is perfect. You know what I mean? Saturdays are always busy no matter where you go. Get your hair together. Get your hair right before you leave so you don't feel like, you know, you're half satisfied. You know, me, I wouldn't want you to come back a week later talking about, yeah, I liked it, but, you know, I would rather you just, me and you get this right now. So, I want to do that video just so you as a client knows that any good stylist would make sure that your hair is right. I'm not going to sit here and rush just because, you know, X amount of people are sitting here. If they're sitting here anyway lined up, you know, like that, it's probably because somebody was late or whatever. You know what I mean? So, I, I don't mind. So, I was just putting that out there. Make sure before you leave the chair, you are satisfied with the services you have received. And me as a stylist, you bring me a picture, I love it. You know, some people don't look at pictures. Some people think, you know... You'd be offending your stylist if you bring a picture. No, bring a picture. If you know what you want, bring a picture because that's a lot better. It's a lot easier for me to see what you're wanting versus you coming here and saying, oh, I want my bang like this, you know. <laughs> that doesn't work. What is this, you know. You want to make sure that you bring pictures and show the styles that you want. Or people be like, oh, did you see so-and-so's hair? I don't watch TV. You know what I mean? It's work and shut eye for me. So, yeah. Bring pictures. We love pictures. And make sure that before you leave the chair, if you are not satisfied with your hair, tell your stylist. I'm not saying that because I've had multiple of these experiences, but I just know some clients will look around and say, oh, she's busy. I don't want to tell her this or I don't want to tell her that. Tell us because, I mean, like I say, any good stylist who cares will make sure that their work is right to your liking before you walk out the door. So, um, that's all I wanted to say for now. Houston Weaves.